Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Tyquees Beauty Tutorials here with another tutorial. On this channel, you guys can find all things beauty. I do all things beauty. Um, so today I'm gonna give you a nice summer glitter glam. So if you guys are interested in how I am going to achieve this look, Y'all need to keep watching. I've, I've, ever, I've already prepped my brows and um, the brow product that I use was by Benefit and I love this product. This is a number five so this is a pomade and I like, I like the way it does. I like the look that I get when I use it and I also use the Tarte concealer to conceal my brows shape and whatnot um so now what we're gonna do i'm gonna dive into a moisturizer and um this is a banana moisturizing cream it looks like this um i will put the um name of this in the description so this is just to hydrate my skin um it's cold outside it's not mm just hit myself in the face all right so i'm just gonna apply this moisturizer i'm just gonna hydrate my skin i like to do my skincare it makes my skin feel so soft i like to do my skincare before i even apply my foundation i like to take care of my skin so i'm just gonna bring this product right on down right on down Apply it on your chest, do your thing. So, now what I'm gonna do is dive into. I, why do I always say dive into? I'm so used to saying dive into. So, I'm gonna dive into this marshmallow NYX, marshmallow NYX primer. Alright, I'm just gonna put this on. So, I'm just gonna do this. And you can maneuver this with a brush or just take your hand and let it go in there. I like to put my primer anywhere where foundation is going to be so that my skin can be protected and the product don't get into my pores. The primer protects your skin. Also, skincare protects your skin as well when you're using your makeup. Um, so, now that we got all that, I'm going to let that dry and sit. Now, um, I'm going to go into a eyeshadow primer and use the Too Faced eyeshadow primer. Apply this on my lid like so. And this is gonna make the colors pop from the eyeshadow that I use. It's gonna make it pop. I'm just gonna take my brush and maneuver this product in. So now that we got the eyes primed, I'm going to grab a palette and the palette that I'm going into is the Morphe um, Jeffree Star palette. I'm going to use this, the colors that I'm going to use. First, first I'm going to go into, I think I'm going to do maybe, hmm. Let's go into Honest Truth. This shade right here, I'm gonna go into Honest Truth. So I'm gonna grab a brush. I'm gonna go on the other side too.
I'm gonna dive into this like hmm I'm gonna do this orange color here this is um, boss angels I'm gonna dive into this orange it's not I'm just tapping it's very pigmented I'm just gonna dive into that and I'm gonna put that underneath the color that I just did I just kind of want to blend that out a little bit here I'm going to bring it over as much as possible. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Then I dive into this like burgundy shade right here and I'm going to put that here. Then last but not least, I'm going to dive into this pink shade, say uh, self-made, I'm going to dive into self-made. Then I'm going to dive back in that color we used in the beginning just to make sure I didn't lose anything. I hope it's the same color here. Yeah, just to make sure I didn't lose anything. I'm going to dive into a brown. And I'm going to put the brown here just to kind of contour this a little bit. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some glitter glue. So I'm going to dive into some glitter glue. Like I told you, this look is going to be really quick and simple. It's not going to take a lot of work to definitely get this look the way I want it because it's a simple look dramatic but simple mostly all of my looks are dramatic and simple most all right so I'm gonna take the glitter glue and dive here all right and I'm gonna just dive into that palette again and I'm gonna pull a sheer color out so that we can mix the glitter and the glitter can kind of pop and it won't be like no see-through so I'm just gonna dive into probably mm, I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do this pink color here well no I'm gonna do dog mom yeah this might be a little too much, but it's actually going to pop when I finish. Okay, I'm going to dive into a little bit more glitter glue.
and I'm gonna apply some glitter so I'm gonna dive into some more glitter glue oh I love this look already so pretty so pretty all right I'm just going to get some of this glue. right looking like this so now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna get us I want another color I want to put some more glitter in there and what I'm gonna do y'all gonna try. I've been loving this ColourPop um, Nightmare Before Christmas it just makes the look so simple and it makes it so easy to finish all your glitter looks for me so I'm just gonna dive, take this brush, the end of this brush, and I'm just gonna dive into that glitter right there. And I'm just gonna put some stones here. Just to kinda close out everything. Like so, there we go. Okay, so now that we got that accomplished, I just want to darken up my edges a little bit as always because I like to have a dark looking closure. I'm just going to spot it. And I'm just going to put a little bit of sheer color up there in this two. I'm using this shade here too. It's like a shimmery shade. And I'm just putting it like underneath the brow bone. And I like to mix my shades like I'm gonna go into Dog Mom and put a little bit of that here too. And that's gonna be it right there. So yeah. Now we're gonna go ahead and apply my foundation. Um, the foundation that I'm gonna be using, I'm gonna go into my Chanel foundation. I'm just going to do two pumps.
and come back and um well i might just go ahead and put my concealer on while you're still watching while you're there so you guys see i take my time and go above these brows i don't want anything to mess us up so now i'm gonna apply the i'm gonna top up my glitter because i'll be kind of disappointed if it dries out because i really love glitter looks for me so i'm diving into the concealer i'm gonna go into my tart shape tape Apply it underneath the eye. Like so. I'm gonna put a few, I'm gonna do this. So I'm gonna blend this out and I'm gonna come back and we're gonna finish this eye look, okay? So I almost forgot to cut the camera back on. So I dive back into this palette and I'm going into this color here and I'm gonna put this underneath the waterline like you see it a little bit. So I gotta... So, a little bit lime green. I think it's going to be cute. And this is a NYX um, pencil. So, where's my mirror? So I did put a wing there. I just got done with it. And now I'm just gonna dive back into that shade that I used and just make sure everything is kind of together underneath here. It depends on what brush you use to girl you just gotta use a brush with a lot of pressure this is a it's cosmetic brush and it has enough pressure so that I can remove the product so I'm gonna go into this real technique brush and kind of put a little bit more of that blush up there from the brush I dive into the Fendi um, Trophy Wife um, highlight. When I wear the Trophy Wife, I get a lot of comments on how pretty this color is. I like to take it underneath the eyes a little bit. Now what I'm gonna do is dive into Anastasia Glow Kit and I'm gonna go into some colors to kind of like I just like to blend my highlights. I love to blend them in with different colors. I don't I, I just love that look. It just gives me not everybody's doing <laughs> you know so I'm gonna put some on my cheek. I 
to me it might be like girl that's too much and you probably like girl you did that anyway so let's highlight the nose I wonder what will happen if we do a purple lip. Like, would that be out? That is a pretty freaking color. So I'm gonna unbraid this lip. Um. Mascara I'm using is but this is wet lash. No, it says it says wild lash and this is urban decay. So I will use any kind of mascara long as it doesn't irritate my eyes, so The finished look I really hope you guys enjoyed this video please please give me a big thumbs up because girl let me tell you something I'm going through a lot uh, in these days and I'm not lying it takes a lot to get on this camera and put these videos out put this content out I'm telling you because it's a lot like I'm all over the place just to be honest with you guys because you guys been watching me for years and some of you guys and I just it's just a lot it's a lot going on you know what I'm saying <laughs> and I'm so it's like this is I'm not in the best place this 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 day you know and yeah i'm really trying to put out content i'm really trying like i always do really try you know to put out content because i really enjoy making these videos um i really enjoy making these videos you know so i'm just doing my best to put out content even if i might be going through a lot of stuff but you know what through all things god is everything i trust him and i believe him for everything that's going on in my life right now okay i'm serious because i really i just i blame myself on a lot of stuff that i've done and um in my life and sometimes when you go through things in your life you just realize like why the fuck did you do that you know so it's like it is what it is but i hope you guys like this content i hope you guys like this look um yeah i see you guys in the next video please do like share comment and subscribe if you guys notice if you've been watching me for years you're gonna know i'm all over the place all right i'm just saying so i forgive me if you notice and if you didn't notice thank god i don't look like what my life is taking me through right now or i don't look like what my decisions has taken me through you know so Thank you for watching. Please do like, share, comment, and subscribe for the next video. We'll be coming up soon. And I'm telling you, girl, Bella Days are coming. Bye. <laughs> Bella Days coming. God.